Hi guys, it's Amy. Today's Q&A is from a male golfer. He was saying that he's having problems with reverse pivoting and he was asking how to fix it. So the proper position in the backswing is when you coil, your head has moved about half a ball to a ball right of the original spot and your spine angle is not perpendicular to the ground but it's about five degrees slanted slightly to the back foot. This is the correct backswing position. But if you're reverse pivoting, usually what happens is a lot of people that can't rotate their hips tend to sway. And then from this position to complete the backswing, you have to lift. And then your spine angle kind of pivots the incorrect way, right? This is the reverse pivot position. And your head is way left of the original spot. This is incorrect. From this position, if you transfer your weight, you're gonna fall over. So most of the times you tend to rock backwards creating that reverse pivot once again and that is really bad for your back so we really don't want to do reverse pivoting. So there are many different reasons why reverse pivot happens. Uh, there are some physical limitations that cause this movement. If you have, if you lack flexibility in your rotational move or in your glute or in your lat, if you're not flexible enough you end up lifting instead of rotating or if you're weak in your right glute then you can't really stabilize properly and it gives in and then you end up with this reverse pivot look and so if you have physical limitation then it's more of a long-term goal you want to work on strengthening and work on stretching so you get a little bit more rotation going but in the meantime, what we can do is we can retrain our body so we rotate correctly. I have a simple drill. For the drill, we're gonna need a tee and a flashlight. We're gonna tee up the golf ball so we take away the part where we're trying to make contact with the golf ball out of the equation so we can focus on the process instead of hitting the ball. All right, let's make it easier on ourselves, right? Okay, this drill, you've probably seen it. If you see my course vlog, it's the Ironman drill. So basically this light is the light that's coming out of the Ironman's chest. So we're gonna be on Ironman and you're gonna flip your club upside down, hold it in your right hand. And our goal is to keep this light pointing down to the ground as much as possible. Because if you're reverse pivoting, the light points at the sky, in the backswing and the downswing, right? So when you're doing this, the highest the light's gonna go is parallel to the ground, never past parallel, okay? Uh, so when you do this, you're gonna realize that you're rotating nicely. And then instead of using front muscles like the front parts of your hips and front parts of your shoulders, you're gonna be using back muscles like mainly your lats, mid-back, and you're going to be rotating instead of lifting. So you Keep your chest down, rotate, keep your chest down, rotate. Do that again, and again, and again. When you keep doing this practice swing, you're going to feel like your head is swinging a lot to the right and a lot to the left. That's mainly because when you used to reverse pivot, your head was way left of the original spot. And when you do it correctly, it's about a ball right of the original spot, which is correct. But the difference between what you're used to and what you're doing right now is a huge difference. That's why it looks like you're swaying. But for a third person's point of view, they're going to say your head looks great. I don't know why you think your head's moving a lot. So this is why what you feel and what you see is different. And this is why you need to get lessons once in a while, film your swing up so you know what you feel matches what it looks like. Let's look at that again. So we want the light from the chest to be shining down the whole time as much as possible. And we're using the back muscles to rotate instead of lift. If you're used to the rotation, let's go ahead and make a full swing. Feeling the chest down, rotation. If you're having problems with reverse pivoting, check out if you have any physical limitations that's causing that reverse pivot. 
work on those, it'd be more of a long-term goal. For the meantime, let's work on the proper rotation. So try this drill and it'll be correct step toward fixing your reverse pivot. If you guys have any more questions, please come to Ask Amy section on my website and leave your questions there. Thanks guys for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one.